Hey, welcome back, Israel, to your Caribou Data Science channel. Today is, well, today is uh, September the 24th, is a Friday evening, and it's time for your daily COVID-19 analysis. Let's see something. Here. Oh, I forgot to do the counts of the, of the cases and deaths today. We'll pick it back up on Sunday, okay? But, of course, you don't forget to click that subscribe button, the like button, and share the video on Facebook and Twitter. You can also copy and paste the link into an email or a text message. Now, let's take a look at a quote from Our World in Data. Um, it says, uh, which countries are on track to have vaccinated 40% of their population with at least one dose by the end of 2021? So I think we can safely say that Israel is beyond that point. But let's just find out here. So you can see that so far Israel has administered 14.8 million doses. Of those doses, uh, 6.07 million have, have received a single dose. And about 5.6 million received the full dose, the full vaccination rate. So let's take a look at the percentages here. Well, 69.1%. So you're well over the 40% mark for single dosage. And you're about 63% for the full vaccination rate. So you've caught, you're, you're well past the benchmarks, okay? So let's just take a look at the, at the numbers now. So you can see currently, uh, Israel, you have you had 12.5 million cases. No, nope, that's not right. 1.2 million cases, and 7,611 deaths. Now, the, now this is not the good, this is not great news. You're you pretty much doubled the number of cases. Uh, 2021 has pretty much doubled the number of cases of 2020, with, uh, with, with three months still to go. And your 2020 ca cases, when deaths have passed the 2020 deaths. But let's just take a look at the individual numbers now. Because you know, a, a lot of those numbers could be from earlier in the year or something like that, okay? So you can see you had this long declining pattern here. Then for whatever reason in July, and it's not just you, other countries have seen this also, there's this big increase in COVID-19 cases right here, okay? The question is, how many of these people here were vaccinated, okay? You can see here, you're, you're at, uh, on uh, September the 8th, you had 22,291 cases. Back on September the 17th, it never fell to 33,040, with a 14-day average of 6,509 cases per day. If we take a look at deaths, we can see here, okay, again, this July spike. You had, you know, you for most of the summer, you had very low deaths. Then you've seen a spike here. So the question is, how many of these people have been vaccinated? Okay. You can see you had a spike here on uh, September the 8th of 56 deaths. On September the 22nd, and then we'd fall to 25 deaths. With a 14-day average of 19 deaths per day. All right. So here you can see this huge spike in cases. Now again, the question is how many of these people were vaccinated? So you can see this big spike in COVID-19 cases, okay? What about deaths? Again, you have, a, you have a spike over here in deaths, 200 deaths uh, three weeks ago, but that's now fallen back down to about 175 last week. But again, how many of these people are vaccinated? And you can see here cases, you know, uh, August, September are the, are, the, are, the, are the second and third most case months so far for cases. What about deaths? Well, 
We can see deaths are almost even for August, September, which means that September's deaths will probably pass August deaths. And this will move the uh, August, September in, into fifth and sixth place for the most number, for the months with the most number of deaths so far. But the deaths are still really low, 600 deaths for a month. That's not bad. Well, that's not good, but I mean, it's it could be a lot worse. Okay, anyway, thanks so much for your time today, Israel. We'll catch you Sunday with an updated report.